I'm Lewis and this is Deal Plays. So in today's instructional video, I'm going to show you how to set up the flap arounds for your airplane. So the first thing you need to know is that to do this, you cannot have a four channel receiver. Because four channels don't work, because in this receiver, there is no flap input. So flaps are channel six, and a four channel receiver is an F channel six. So what I'm gonna do is take off the lens for the second cup and put it aside. So here it is. So here I have the six channel receiver. As you can see, one of the ailerons is connected to channel one, which would be the left side if you see it the correct way. And the right side aileron is connected to channel six. So before setting up your flap runs, don't stick the servos yet. Because the first time I set up my flap runs, I stuck the servos the other way. So the cable was down here and this was down here. So it didn't work because I'm going to explain to you right now. So you have your transmitter. So I'm not sure if a transmitter that is not digital, like this one, will not work on the flap runs even though it has six channel. So what I do is you have your six channel transmitter, you connect your battery to your servos. Okay. So first of all, before sticking the servos, you check that they work properly. And then you put the mode in your transmitter for flapperons. The flapper mode should be FLPR. So you turn it on like that and then you check it works. So you can change the intensity for flapperons. Like that. You just pass the switch to activate the flapperons and you move the switch up and down. So you can make it less or more. What I usually like to do is around 40, 45, that will be good enough. So that pretty much settles it. So next you check that your alarms are going the proper way. Yeah. So as it is working, when you set up to fly your airplane, the first flight you do, before doing it, before putting the flapper on board, go up very very high because the first time it can fail and everything can go down or do anything so to avoid any of those errors that can occur while passing the flap around switch the first time checking it out go up around the highest you can see the airplane and you test out the flap around to see if that works fine and then you can bring it lower and test it out now, some people say that while doing the flap around switch that you activate it, the airplane can tend to go down. So if that happens to you, hit your up down switch to make the airplane go up. So this is pretty much how you set up your ailerons on your airplane. Now, be sure that this only works if you have two servos and that's the switch to So this is one way of doing the the flapper rolls on your airplane. So if you want to see on Friday the new motor we got and on Sunday the F-18 flying, just click the button and subscribe.